There are a number of bio-artificial liver um, machines, if you like to call them that, available, but most of those are built to detoxify blood by effectively filtration of, of toxins out of the blood and then put the blood back to the patient. What we're looking at is an artificial liver which actually performs the functions of, of a real liver so it can effectively take over a little bit from their, their liver so add a little bit of extra support. That's possible, it has been possible using um, uh, human liver cells but they don't last very long so and you can't get very many of them they don't they don't tend to, to grow very well in culture they don't tend to keep very well in culture what we are trying to do is produce effectively liver cells which will grow and be maintained and can be then used in, in an artificial liver and these will be human cells so that we know somebody might be coming in for therapy on the bioartificial liver we know when that might be. We then produce enough cells to populate the bioartificial liver reactor and use that for, for treatment. So the cells can then be discarded and we can then grow up some more for the next session we need to use for artificial liver support. So it's this idea of being able to, to grow, maintain real human liver cells, which work as liver cells, but not to use liver tissue, not to use pig tissue. It's, it's a really sort of... Um, exciting prospect for us and it's showing some some degree of success. Mm -hmm.